Welcome back to Visual English Book 5, Unit 5. Today, we will be talking about all the fun things we can do during the winter months. This unit consists of six pages, and we will be focusing on two main parts of this unit. In the first part, we will be discussing um, uh, equipment needed for winter, activities such as skiing and snowboarding and skating. We will talk about what equipment is necessary and why, and so you will be prepared for your next winter adventure. We will also be focusing on using past tenses and practicing present simple and present continuous and past simple. And by the end of this section, we will be able to talk about your past winter experiences with no problems. In the second part of the unit, we'll also, the third, I'm sorry, the third part of the unit, we will also be practicing our writing skills by writing about our past winter experiences. And we'll, as usual, be using our flashcards uh, to make the learning experience fun and more interactive for our students. So let's take a look at our winter uh, flashcards. So as you can see here, we have the first part of the uh, unit where we were going to be talking about equipment. So here we're discussing about helmets. Here we're talking about sleds, whether you have a plastic, a metal, a wooden sled. We will be asking about the clothes you wear during the winter. So here you can see you have winter boots, snow suits, um, and gloves and mittens, earmuffs, and we'll be discussing whether or not they're cute, they're not cute. Of course, we will be discussing places where people go to ski or to sledge or to snowboard. We'll be discussing about the difficulties of, uh, for example, slopes, if they're able to uh, ski on such kind of slopes. Do they usually go skiing during the winter break? And of course, here we are talking about skating and their skills, skating skills, and if they have this kind of shoes. And once we finish discussing about all the equipment and things necessary for skating, be it equipment, be it places, then we can go to the second part of the unit where we will be talking about uh, experiences or things we do during or activities we do during the winter. So uh, here is the second part of the lesson. So what are they doing? As you can see, we are focusing on, focusing on present continuous. And here, what are you doing? Do they like sledging? Do they sledge during the winter? So here we have present simple tenses. And did they sledge last uh, winter or not? So we have so many activities from sledging to um, clearing the snow, and from clearing to the snow, from, to making sandcastles, and from sandcastles to ice skating, and um, skiing, and snowboarding, and snow tubing, and all these wonderful activities to engage our students in such fun winter activities. Snow angels, ice fishing. Once we have finished, and to make our learning experience more enjoyable, we also have some fun online activities to play with our students and of course we have to go into our word wall and which i have discussed before we have an account on the word wall all you have to do is log in and you can see you have the activities here we have a quiz on helmets and of course we have a match a match picture matching activity and finally, we have ISL uh, Collective, where you could just write here um, winter ESL activities. And we have a wonderful film, interactive, of course, where the students can watch and answer the questions concerning winter. And to cut the story short, we also have a YouTube film, What You Do in the Winter. So this will be our right uh, would you do either play it in the beginning of the lesson or at the end of your lesson to engage your students in activities which they can do during the winter. So I hope you're going to enjoy your winter lesson with your students.